Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been an awfully long time since I've done a video on here. Um, so I am back and I wanted to do today a fake unboxing for you guys and show you what I got for my 40th birthday. So we will get right into that. So of course, um, I told my husband I didn't want any party. I wanted a Louis Vuitton bag. And so he didn't listen to the party thing. He did have a surprise party for me, um, which was awesome. Um, and then on my actual birthday, which was um, January 6th, um, my son plays hockey. So after his hockey game, um, we were by um, my local LV. Um, I don't have one too close to me. It's about like an hour away. Um, but it was right by where my son was playing hockey. So afterwards, um, he took me there. And I got my new girl for my birthday. So, yes, we went to Louis Vuitton. And excuse that I'm in the kitchen. This was just the best way where I can put my phone so that I can get this big, gigantic bag in the camera for you guys um, and show you everything. Plus, I um, thought it would be easier to do some mod shots in here as well. So, back to... Yes, we went to Louis Vuitton. And like I said, this is a fake unboxing because I did not have time to actually unbox it the day I got it. And um, I'm an impatient person and I wanted to start using it right away. So I just figured for the video, um, I'd throw it back in the box in the bag and show you guys. So um, the bag does have all of my stuff in it. So... This is the ginormous box that it came in. Any guesses of what it might be? And then it did come with, this is my receipt here. Black it out, but there's my receipt. And then it also came with a little care booklet as well. So. And here it is in her dust bag. And I got the, if I can grab it here. The Louis Vuitton, the flower hobo in the color noir. So absolutely in love with this bag. Um, this bag actually comes in a couple of different colors. So you have your noir. Um, there is like a burgundy one, which I think is called um, Bordeaux. I could be saying that wrong. Um, then there is your regular um, Vaquetta one, just with your... Um, untreated leather and then you also have um, a new color that came out and it's called caramel so this bag um, I have not seen too many reviews on YouTube um, so just a little bit about this bag so again it has your um, canvas here you have this beautiful flower detail or I think they say it actually a different way um, but I call it the flower <laughs> and then you have your beautiful lock right here it comes with the key bell that I did have my initial put on when I was there that day. Again, you have your um, leather handle up here, and this is in the black, the color noir. You have your Louis Vuitton Paris right up there at the top of the handle. And then you also have your Louis Vuitton Paris right here on the inside of the handle. So my bag was made in the USA, so it just has the Louis Vuitton Paris right there, and then obviously it has the fabric stamp on the inside. Um, you've got a seam right here. I was not too happy that this does not line up the greatest, um, you can see like right here and right here. Um, and then there was another spot on the other end. Um, but this was the only bag that they actually had 
um, in the store. And so it wasn't like anything like too horrible. So, um, I was just like, I'm going to deal with it. Plus, like I said, I'm a very impatient person. So to have to wait maybe a week or something. So I was like, it is what it is. Um, the inside, and like I said, I do have my stuff in there because I have been using it, is a microfiber lining. And it is um, the same color, the Noir. And then you also have a zip pocket right back here. And then you have the keys here, which unlock this lock. And then you have on the other side, a hidden pocket right here. So you cannot, if you could see like with it locked, I cannot get my hand in there. So it's great. Like if you're going to carry, um, you know, if you're traveling, maybe put your passport in there or something like that. Um, that's probably actually what I will use it for. Um, you know, just something that you want to keep locked up and you don't want, you know, anybody to get. Um, it does have a magnetic closure. So you have the flower on this side. And then you have flower on this side. And then so when you line them both up like that and it closes and then I will show you how deep this pocket is um, once I go ahead um, and I'm going to do um, a what's in my bag and as soon as the bag's all empty then I can go ahead and unlock that and um, show you that for you so um, but we'll go ahead and do what is in my bag so this one is um, very similar to um, your speedy and neverfuls. So it's just, it has the back zipper pocket, but other than that, it's just a big open hole. So I do have an organizer in there, as you can see, um, just to kind of keep my stuff, um, a little bit more, um, organized. And obviously it's why it's called an organizer. Um, so I'm going to start back with my back pocket and in there, I just have my Tom Ford lipstick, and this is number 68, um, Sugar Glider. It's actually what I have on my lips right now. Um, I have my um, Too Faced. This is called Miss Thing, um, and I'm a sucker for packaging, so actually when I saw this, I was like, oh my God. Um, the color's more kind of like a um, nude, it's very pretty. Um, it does put glitter on as well. And then I have my um, Too Faced Melted Matte, um, and this is called um, the Melted Clover. So that's what I keep in my back compartment. And then I also have, um, i go ahead and slide back a little bit so I'm in the camera. Um, I have my full-size wallet. Um, this is um, Michael Kors wallet. I got this as a gift for Christmas. Um, I've been using my, um, uh, I think it's called the Victorine coin purse, my Louis Vuitton one. Um, but I needed this because um, I like that it's bigger. Um, so I've got, you know, my card slots here. You've got card slots in the back here. You've got a spot, you know, for cash. Um, I keep receipts for work, so I like that I can keep all that um, and put things in this back pocket. So I've just been using this for right now. Um, then I have in my organizer, I just have some hand wipes. And then I have um, this that was also um, given to me um, as a Christmas gift. There was, you know, a bunch of makeup and stuff inside, but Again, I love everything glitter, so I have this cute little red pouch. Um, and in here, I just have my pill case. Um, I have my um, sample of um, the J'adore, um, Christian Dior J'adore. Um, this came with my perfume that I got for Christmas. Um, I have my um, Apple earbud, ear pods in here. I have a hair tie. And then I just have um, some Band-Aids and that's all that I keep in that. 
Um, I also have my Chanel hand cream. I have um, this cute little coach. Um, it's actually like a card holder and it has a little keychain on it. It's super cute. Um, again, this was also a Christmas gift, um, or I'm sorry, no, this was a birthday gift from a, for a friend, from a friend. And I keep my business cards in there. So um, it just fits perfectly in my organizer. Um, I did have some like loyalty cards in there, but like I said, when I switched out to my um, Michael Kors wallet, um, I've just been using this for business card. Um, I'm loving this color. It is absolutely gorgeous. And then I have my Saworski pen. And I think that's it. Oh, and then I have some hand sanitizer from Bath and Body. Um, so again, so I'm gonna take this out, my stuff out of there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and show you. So like I said, in here, you have your two keys, okay? So there's your keys. So when you go ahead and then you can unlock this, just like that, okay? And then as you see, there's this little knob. Let me show you from the side there. So you're gonna turn that sideways and then that's going to pop open your pocket right here in the front. So again, it's very deep. There's my hand and it goes all the way down to my wrist. So, and again, you can keep it undone if you are the type and you want to, you know, use that pocket quite a bit um, for, you know, essentials or anything like that. Um, but I definitely really like the lock on the front. So I keep um, the lock on there. And then again, so you're just going to turn it and then you're gonna slide the lock back in. Pull your keys out and then there you go. And then now your lock is back on there. So, um, so yeah, so it's awesome. Um, I like that feature. It kind of reminds me of the Speedy where, um, you know, you lock your bag, you know, you want to keep something private in there. So I'm going to put my stuff back in real quick here for you. And then I'm going to do a couple of mod shots and just show you, um, you know, this is a shoulder bag. So there's really only one way that, you know, you can use this bag. Um, but if you, you can at least get an idea of, you know, how it is on my um, frame type. So I am 5'4", and this is the bag on my shoulder. It stays on really good. I heard people saying that um, they had a problem with it staying on the shoulder. I have not. I also have a very big um, down coat, and it stays on with my coat and everything. So um, like a typical shoulder bag, I mean, you know, when you're bending over at the store to get something, it may slide off a little bit. Um, but I usually just kind of throw it more towards the back like that. And then I don't have any problem as far as bending over. Um, but it does. It stays on very nice. Um, so the handle is nice and thick and it's also very comfortable too on the shoulder. So this is in the front. This is the side view of it. And then your back view. Okay, and then again, you can also carry it on the crook of your arm as well if you wanna do that. So I'm not a fan like this just because it is more of the hobo bag. Um, I have carried it like this because if I need to get something you know, out pretty quick or whatever, or I'm grabbing it to run in somewhere, um, but majority of the time I, I do just kind of carry it on my shoulder just like that. So it does have enough um, space right here in between your arm that you can reach in and, you know, grab out something that you need, your wallet. 
So, um, so it does have that for you as well. Um, and then you can snap it back up and then you're good to go. So yeah. So thank you guys so much for um, watching my video. Um, I hope to have a few more videos for you guys um, in 2019. If you haven't, please subscribe down below and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.